This is code of our background color. Find the code in the style sheet that is making the background color of the entire page light blue. Change the background color of the page. Try to change the background color of just paragraphs. Awesome. Okay. So obviously light blue. Now keep in mind right now, this is the HTML file. This is where we write the stuff, where we add image elements. Okay. It's not the direct style. What is giving us the style? Well, as we've learned, if I look at line four, it gives it away, right? We have a style sheet and that is named style.css. So let me head over here and there it is. Here's the file. These are separate files. If they were on their desktop, they'd be separate icons. All right. And so this is a, just like a Word doc, this is a .css doc, .html doc. Now, what's causing the whole thing to be light blue? Huh. Well, I think that's a pretty indication. Let's give it a shot. I don't know, red? You do your own color. Ooh, do they give us? Ooh, we can scroll. That's kind of ugly. Oh, well. all right. Green, yellow for me. And then it asked about an individual paragraph. Well, notice how they do this background hyphen color. So let's see. I know for a paragraph, the letter P is what creates a paragraph. And it looks like they've already got some styles here. So I guess I could add it to the bottom. I'm going to go to line 26 and hit enter. And now I have a blank line 27. And what I'm going to do then is, well, let's do this background color. So I'm just going to start typing. And guys, you should be lazy. They give you this. This is like professional website design software and programming software. They will give you fast ways to get the text in there. That way, you know, it's spelled right and all of the details, right? Because you do need the hype and the word color. This is a semicolon. You need all of it. All right. And then, oh, backgrounds of paragraphs. Is that awkward? That's pretty ugly. Sure. And because I want this proper, I'm going to put a semicolon, which is the key next to the letter L. Now I also want it lined up because it's good form. Ta-da! Looking good. Onward.